Dorothy's on her way to the Royal Palace of Ev with her new mechanical friend, TikTok. She wants to tell TikTok's mistress, Princess Lulu, to stop sending TikTok off to Wheeler Country to steal their hats. Lulu has a hat collection and, well, let's just say this princess sounds peculiar. What a strange sign. I can't understand it at all. It's in Evian. It says, knock on the left door, if you please. The left door? But there's no door to the left of this one. It's the only door here. This is very confusing, TikTok. You see, there used to be a lot of doors here, but the princess got rid of them. And this is the only door left. See what I mean? This is the left door. Oh. Told you she was strange. When she put up that sign, she had on a funny hat. Knock. But remember, her personality will match whatever hat she's wearing. Well, here goes. Anybody home? Hello? Uh, Princess Lulu? Who's this, TikTok? And where is the hat I, uh, the princess ordered? Didn't you get it? Uh-huh. Sorry. Your secret mission failed? Uh-huh. This is quite disappointing. Uh, the princess will be furious when she is informed of this disgraceful lapse on your part. You know how much she wanted a wheeler hat. That's why I'm here, miss. May I see the princess? Who is this strange girl, TikTok? I'm sorry, I should have introduced myself, miss. Good day. I'm Dorothy. I want to tell the princess she shouldn't steal hats. She won't like it. She must have hundreds of hats. Why try and steal more of them? One moment. Please, Your Majesty. What is it now? There's someone to see you. Who? Who wishes to see me? Am I imagining things, or do those voices belong to the same person? I didn't warn you about her, Dorothy. Well, who did you say you were? I'm Dorothy from Kansas, Your Highness, ma'am. Dorothy from Kansas? What's going on here? I sent TikTok to bring me a hat, and he brings me a Dorothy from Kansas instead? <gasps> it simply won't do! Told you. Well, oh. come in a piece. Now just wait right there while I see if Her Majesty is ready. Are you ready to see them, Your Highness? Oh, I suppose so. I have nothing better to do today, except perhaps to take TikTok apart and see what makes him tick or talk. Oh, it's all such a bore. Dorothy of Kansas, Your Highness. Dorothy from the Kingdom of Kansas? Never heard of it. And I've heard of all the kingdoms worth being heard of around here. <laughs> it's not a kingdom and it's not around here. No. It's farm country. We grow corn, wheat, and apples. And we raise chickens and a few pigs. Hmm. You're not royalty, yet you dare to come into my presence? TikTok, what is the meaning of this? I am not in the habit of dealing with peasants! Yes, ma'am, I told her not to come. I knew you wouldn't like it, but she insisted, and I was afraid to come alone without a wheeler hat, and when she... Quiet, you hear? You pile of pots and pans! Sorry, ma'am. As for you, farm girl, I'm here to ask why you steal hats. Hmm. If a princess does it, it's royal tribute, not theft. Everything really belongs to me. I merely take whatever I want whenever I want it. It's my right. So there! Your Highness, princess or not, taking what's not yours is called stealing where I come from. Come up here and say that, my dear. Huh? Go. Go on. Well. Hurry up, hurry up! I haven't got all day! I don't like dawdlers, Dorothy! Hmm, what is it that I find so irritating about you? Let me see. Uh, uh, imagine being hatless. <laughs> but you're not even wearing a ribbon or a hat pin. Shameful! Well, I could make a hat from your hair. No! Uh -huh. You can't have my hair. I don't care if you're a princess or not. You're very, very rude, Lulu. Your manners are atrocious, and real royalty doesn't go around stealing hats from poor people. You ought to be ashamed of yourself, and I'm not a peasant. 
It's not my fault. I crave hats like other people crave food. I have oh. to change my mood often, and I need hats to do it. Oh, dear. <laughs> I'm sorry I made you cry. I didn't know hats were that important to you. I must have hats! <laughs> Maybe you've gone too far. Maybe they're bad for you. If they make you have such strange moods, why wear them at all? Go bareheaded. Huh? Bareheaded? Never! Never! The very idea is indecent! You have the nerve to suggest that I go bareheaded! You terrible child! I'm going to make you pay dearly for that horrible suggestion! TikTok will also pay for bringing you here! You ruined my entire day! So it's off to the dungeon for both of you! decide what to do with you two later on. But right now, I have guests arriving, and I must go select what hat I shall wear. Oh, we haven't done anything wrong. Why do you have to lock us up? You hurt me. You made me cry. Goodness, her moods do change fast, don't they, TikTok? It's that hat. She always acts like that when she's wearing it. She has hundreds of hats, and each one makes her act in a different way. You ought to see her with her crash helmet on. <sighs> no, makes me feel blue. I've got to find a hat that'll give me lots of charm. I have to be at my best for this conference with Ozma. <sighs> I need her help, so my mood must be enchanting. <sighs> <laughs> And when she wears her magician's hat, she keeps pulling rabbits out of it. What kind of hat would get her to let us out of this dungeon? I don't think she has one for that. I'm awfully hungry, TikTok. When's supper? I'm afraid you may have a long wait. That is, unless she puts on a chef's hat. We'll have to wait till then. That's the way Princess Lulu runs things around here, Dorothy. No one in the whole palace knows what to expect from one minute to the next. On bad days, all her moods are terrible. Huh? But hasn't she got some hats that make her feel kind and forgiving to strangers? Yes, but she finds them dull. The door is the only way out. <gasps> My ticker's sending me negative talks. Huh? I'm sure I heard something. I didn't have my ears turned up, but now I do. Yes, yes, I definitely hear something. A scratching noise. I'll try to locate it. My sensor tells me it's not human oh. and has four legs. It also has a very long tail and sharp teeth. Oh, my. Oh. oh. I hope it's not a monster. A mouse. Oh, boy. What a relief, TikTok. Yes. How are you doing? I'm just looking for scraps. I don't see a crumb. Most prisoners leave something for me. Hmm. I'm made of metal, Mr. Mouse, so I don't eat. And Lulu hasn't said anything for Dorothy. Oh, that's too bad for both of us. Oh, well, might as well keep you company. Uh, you're not scared of mice, are you? Nope. When I was in Oz, some of my best friends were mice. Hmm? That's right. Ever been to Oz? No, but I've got family there. You wouldn't by any chance be Dorothy. Why, yes, I am. Amazing. How on earth did you know that? Easy. Warrior Mouse is my cousin. He told me all about your adventures with Scarecrow and Tin Man on his last visit. He mentioned a lion, too. What a team! Said he helped you free the Emerald City! That's putting it mildly. We couldn't have done it without him. We called him our secret weapon. He's quite a mouse. Mm-hmm. 
If Warrior Mouse comes to visit, that must mean Oz isn't far from here, huh? Well, it's not right in our backyard, and you have to cross a desert to get to it, but it's not all that far, no. Nope. <laughs> Dorothy, may I ask a question? Of course. Maybe if Mr. Mouse didn't mind you being a friend of his cousins and all, he could help us get out of this place. What do you think? Of course. I know it's a lot to ask. An awful lot, but if he would... I'd be honored to help in any way I can. Oh, thank you, Mr. Mouse. Lulu has no idea that Dorothy and TikTok are plotting their escape. She's waiting for her guests. Oh. <gasps> oh. Princess Ozma and her friends are here. Oh, well, I found the right hat. Can't get more lovey-dovey than this. <laughs> Makes me feel kind of flighty, though. I'm coming. <laughs> Mm-hmm. You're sure it won't take you long to reach him? Uh-huh. Good luck. Why, Lulu's guests are none other than Princess Ozma, Scarecrow, Tin Man, and Jack Pumpkinhead. Mr. Mouse scampers off unnoticed in the excitement of their arrival as Lulu greets her distinguished visitors. <laughs> Come on. Meantime, scurrying as fast as his little legs will carry him, Mr. Mouse speeds towards the great forest of Oz, where its king is dreaming his favorite dream about the day he met Dorothy. What's that lion doing over there? Coward. Hey, wake up, Your Majesty! Come on! Oh, oh, Mr. Mouse, I hope you've got a good reason for waking me. Oh, I do. Friends of yours are in big trouble. Oh, well, that's different. I'll come right along as soon as I finish. Oh, uh, 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 my dream. Be with you in a flash, Mr. Mouse. No, wait! You can't sleep now! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Uh, stop doing that! <gasps> Look, will you leave me alone? No! No, this is an emergency! You're the only one who can help! I can't help if I'm exhausted. I need my sleep, you know. Mm, can't be brave and daring if you're too pooped to stand up. No. Besides, I was dreaming of when Dorothy was here. But Dorothy is here! She's the one who's in trouble! Lulu's put her in the dungeon in the land of Ev, and we all know what Lulu's like. Who knows what she might do? Dorothy's here? Oh, this is wonderful news. Of course, it's awful that Lulu's got her, though. You're not kidding. Why do you think I wouldn't let you sleep, Your Majesty? We've got to get her out, and soon. Take me to her, Mr. Mouse. I'll get her out no matter what hat Lulu's wearing. Now you're talking, Your Majesty. Help you desperately need, Princess Lulu. If you could. Like my hat doesn't make me look like a bird brain, does it? Oh no, it's a. Uh, well, it's uh, unique. That's what it is. Oh, I knew you'd like it. <laughs> About this help, Lulu, we can't say whether or not we can help you till you tell us what the problem is. <laughs> I've been feeling so lovey-dovey, I've forgotten all about the dreadful mess I'm in. You see, my brother the prince is in Gnome Land, which means I have to rule his place. And you know how annoying that can be. Boring state dinners, kissing babies, leading parades, making speeches. I'd rather stay home and play with my hats. Well, I can sympathize with you, princess. I was the king of Oz once, and I didn't like it at all. Bored me to tears. Good thing we found Ozma. I'm not bored. 
but I am puzzled. Why doesn't your brother just come home, Lulu? Oh, Princess, I do so admire your quiet but direct manner. You come right to the heart of the matter without wasting any time. What a question. Why doesn't the Prince come home? I just love it! <laughs> well, why doesn't he, ma'am? Mm -hmm. hmm. Oh, because he's a prisoner, of course. That mean old gnome king captured him and locked him up in his palace. I see. So you want us to go and rescue the prince, is that it? You don't! I know I could count on you! Oh, I'm so happy. I could just cry. My brother's going to be rescued at last. Oh, I've been so miserable without him. I love him as much as my hands. Oh, my hands. They've been so lonely without me. I'm down to a dozen a day. And I'm getting sick of wearing that silly old crown! Nothing's quite so dull as royal headgear! Hmm. So you see, you must rescue the prince. For my sake, you wouldn't want poor me to rule the land of Ev forever, would you? Mm -hmm. Oh, no! Oh, it is a rather chilling thought, Lulu. Oh, we wouldn't want that, no. We'll do it. Oh, goody, can I go too, Ozma? Hmm? I'd be good honest. Sorry, Jack, but we won't be going. I have a country of my own to rule. Lulu, I can't desert Oz for as long as it would take to rescue him. I'm sorry. But, Ozma, if we don't go, that leaves only Tin Man and Scarecrow, and they can't do it all alone. Jack's right. The odds against us will be far too great. I'm afraid we won't be able to help after all. Oh! Oh! How will I ever get my poor prince back? <sighs> sorry, Princess Lulu. We could have done it in the good old days, if only Lion and Dorothy were here. Mm -hmm. It's taking Mr. Mouse an awfully long time to get back. He may have run into trouble along the way. I hope Princess Lulu isn't wearing her cat hat. But he did say where he was going was quite a scamper from here, didn't he? Mm -hmm. Dorothy. <laughs> I've heard that name. Ah, those were the days. Scarecrow, Dorothy, me. What a gift to hear lions roar. <laughs> Lion, are you feeling all right? Scarecrow, hey, are you in on this? In on what? Tin Man, what? You didn't help Lulu put Dorothy in the dungeon, did you? Of course not. Are you saying Dorothy's in Lulu's dungeon, Lion? Our Dorothy? According to Mr. Mouse. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I put your Dorothy in the dungeon, whoever she is. Oh, yeah? Well, I can, Lulu. And I intend to go down and have a look around for myself. Nobody locks up Dorothy, understand? The truth, Lulu, is she down there or not? Ouch! This cat is a terror. <laughs> Answer the man! I'm I'm confused, Lion. What's that mouse got to do with all this? Will you just tell us what's going on around here, please? Mr. Mouse is the one who told me Lulu put Dorothy in the dungeon, and I'm here to rescue her. No, no, it's a lie. A lie. Oh, leave me alone. <laughs> it is not a lie, Princess. Mr. Mouse says he spoke to Dorothy in the dungeon of this very castle. <laughs> really? What are we waiting for? Hold it right there. Mm. Huh? I remember. I did lock up a Dorothy. She was rude to me. I always lock people up who hurt my feelings. Tin Man, we'd better rescue that prince. It's time somebody else was in charge of this place. Where is this dungeon you put Dorothy in? Uh, I don't remember. It slipped my mind. I'm very busy being me, you see. It's a full-time job. Poor me. <laughs> no one understands me. <laughs> me or my hats. <laughs> I think I'm strange, bizarre even. But I'm not! <laughs> I'm as normal as the rest of you, maybe even more normal. <laughs> Her moods change too fast for me. Maybe we should just find Dorothy and go. I just wish we'd been able to help your brother, Princess Lulu. <laughs> Hey, everybody, I just thought of something. Once we free Dorothy, then the four of us will be back together again. <laughs> we can all go and rescue the Prince of Ev. Oh, Tin Man, how clever. Now I can return to Oz knowing that you four are certain to succeed. Wait, why don't I send TikTok along as my contribution? TikTok? Huh? Who's he? You'll love him. He's mechanical. He can do all sorts of things. <laughs> <laughs>
He sounds good to me. We'll take any help we can get. We're off on an adventure. Yeah. <laughs> Dorothy free, she's about to set off on her greatest adventure yet. 